And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Satisfactory. Since we last were here, I actually did fix a few things. I made this basically because production so fast on both of these go into one storage. I fixed some of the power lines so I can actually follow where they're going. Uh, moved a few things around. Things like that. I put some new power lines. I put down a diesel engine there just to basically follow the power lines so it all makes sense to me. I want to make this more and more efficient, but you know. I was also looking at the overclocking here, and I think I do have enough. This will allow me to overclock production. I do not know where I build that. <laughs> because I wanted to speed up our metal plate. Um, this is a little slow. Power shard requires one green power slug. So I need to find green power slugs. So we're going to be adventuring today. Um, let me make sure... Pod ruler turn in one minute. Nice. Yeah, I did the flower p petals. R&D wishes me to tell you these colored petals are useful for two things. Dating and creating color cartridges. Mandatory <laughs> reminder that you are under 24-7 surveillance. The derived blueprint is now accessible in the hub. Uh, barrel nut here, please. There we go. Want to make sure that our research is always going. So I can put away most of this for now. I'm going to take these with me. And we're going to go find a power slug because I want to speed up the efficiency. That's what the power slug research did. Our power slug was right up there, so hopefully we can find it. I'm gonna adventure a little bit. I mean, our, our factory is working A-OK -okay on its own. Obviously gonna be picking up leaves on my way to make things much nicer. And keep wood production up. I am gonna have to get the chainsaw. That's for sure. That'll allow me to just get wood and build wood pulp or whatever. I believe there's also biodiesel that I can make. I don't know. I don't know how you would harvest wood to put into your factory, though. Like, is there, if there's, if there's something that I can build to harvest wood from, like, the ground or something? Or little drones or something? That looks nutty up there. Yeah, this planet is quite large. Got to keep my eye out for a power slug. There's a cave. I do not want to die. But I did not bring a lot with me, so. Whoa. I don't know how I'd get back up. That's crazy, though, that this is here. Might be able to usefully... Or... Might be useful in the future. Stumbling on my words a little bit there. We okay? No roly-poly here. There's one. We're basically looking for shiny. Look at that. I see one. There's a power slug. That's what we need, guys. Oh. Hello, factory. I need you. Hyper efficiency. Yeah, I want to start setting up a few more kind of factory. I, I don't know what the best word. Production lines would be probably the word. To produce like screws and reinforce things like that. Uh, I think that's going to be important for us as well. I'm going to keep grabbing these because they give us health. While I'm at it, I'm just going to... Just like that.
Interesting. I would say things are going well, though. Alright, should be able to build it here. Okay, now what do I do with this? Do I put it? Oh, I put it here. Alright, we just overclocked to 150%. Is that what we can do? Get some more power and this is way faster. That's what we needed, guys. Build another one, go to 200%. Oh. Having metal plates come out like that is amazing, though. Uh, let's go look at our research real fast. Make sure that we are on the right track. Personal storage, not exactly. Object scanner. For a set item. Color gun, walkways, jump pads, obstacle clearing. That's what we want, chainsaw. 500, we need 200 plate. And 300 rod. 200 rod. We have the wire. How is rod production? Perfect. And plate production is going real well now. Thank you. More plates. I didn't take enough plates with me. All right. Obstacle clearing Last has been learned. Reached. Additional to an inventory expansion, you are now capable of removing foliage that consists primarily out of wood. Barrel nuts added to object scanner catalog. Okay, we should now be able to build the chainsaw. Which would be here. Screws, cable, reinforced iron plate. Need more iron plates. That way. Yeah, see, I want to get into, like, reinforced iron plate, which is two production lines merging into one. Be very useful. We need screws and cable. 15 cable. Oh, I love that production line. Okay, and screws. Yeah, produce screws and things like that. And chainsaw? We need iron rods. Of course we do. Just built all the screws. Done. Very nice. Oh, we need biodiesel for it? One of these should be biodiesel. Part assembly. Clearing. Part assembly. Utility. Utility. We gotta wait. I understand. Okay. So while we're at that, I'm trying to think. I don't have like a splitter yet. Gonna take a double check. 
a splitter. Splits conveyor belt into three. Oh, we do have a splitter. So what I could do is split. Some of these plates off here. All right, real fast. I need to read. This is rods that makes screws. So we need to split off from the rods to make some screws. Bring it around over here to split off the plates to build reinforced plate. Okay. Um. Hmm. I'd like to find another slug. What's going on here? This is out of power. It's kind of a waste. I can make that into diesel, but for now, we'll just keep the production line moving. Okay, we have 55 seconds until that returns. Yeah, I'll take another look around for a slug nearby. So I can just speed up the production of uh, iron rods as well. That will help with the, all of our production. The more slugs, the better, it seems like. That's kind of how everything's worked. I see one. You see it? Right there. I love the jumping. Yeah, it seems like those power slugs are super useful. Waterfalls. I haven't gotten near one of those bigger creatures yet, so... That's a thing. All right, let's see. How do I get to you, Mr. Power Slug? Oh no. No, 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 no. All right, we gotta fight. All right, we did kill it, but those things always beat me up pretty well. They seem to be near the forests. The more forested areas. Alright, I don't know how I'm going to get up to that power slug. Oh, you're just a roly-poly. There's a power slug down there, too. I don't know what's protecting it. I am going to grab both of them. Efficiency, guys. Super efficiency. Whoa. Um. Quick wire? needs quick wire uh, a crash site I have no idea what quick wire is, so. Oh, we're falling. We're falling. That's a spitter. Oh, no. Ow. I'm just going to avoid the spitter. I do see a lot of power slugs, though. Green power slug. We're just going to go with the jump a -rooney. We need to remember where that is. It's not far from base. We will be able to kind of figure it out. 
but another power slug. Oh. My computer's audio actually just cut out. Um, That's my own computer, so I will be right back, guys. Give me one second. And we're back, ladies and gentlemen, after me basically crashing my sound card. That's my own fault. I gotta update some drivers. It's basically what I gotta do. Raw quartz. You know what? I want to take some with me just in case there's research. What are you? No. Uh. Oh, copper. Duh. Does it say bacon agaric? Or agaric? We're just going to keep moving. We found the drop pod. We have the two power slugs so we can speed up our efficiency. I'm hoping finding that ore right there will help us upgrade to future technologies as well. We need to build the space elevator. That is a thing. Running back to base. Crash site was this direction. So if we head north, northwest, we should find it again. Need to remember that. I see another power slug from here. Right now we have... Oh, we have a yellow power slug. Ooh. I wonder what that does. Huh. We know about green. There's like a power slug directly above my base. All right. Nope, not chainsaw. We're going to have a lot of stuff to research, though. I'm going to get that power slug. There's another one right there. All right, so they're not as rare as I thought they were going to be. I guess hyper efficiency. <laughs> okay. Well, let's get that one. The one closer to base I can just grab. Kind of spooky at nighttime. I'm just waiting to get, like, jumped. You hear these noises, and it's just like, whoa. So the farther I get to get away from base, the more new stuff I'm seeing. Interesting. No point in skipping out on some biofuel here. Can we live the fall? Yeah, we can. Very nice. Uh, we have a power issue here. Or it seemed like we did. going on we can make this more efficient interesting go look at research real fast get yellow power slug uh bacon Research the yellow one. I want to know what that does. Okay, so what is what would this do? More power, more power. I mean, not a bad thing. Not a bad thing indeed. So, if I were to do this... And just pump out iron plates. The power will die. Got it. Where Where is this hooked into a power grid? Wait. Where? Wait. 
Where is the power coming from? That engine right there. This allowed it to keep going. Got it. I don't want you inside of this. I don't want you inside of this one. Yeah. Look at the super, super clock speeds now on this baby. Oh, she's pumping them out. And of course. It's too, too much on this line. What about 130%. I know I can read numbers, but trial and error. All right. This power line is not ready for you. <sighs> Was not ready for superpower. Build a bunch of biomass. Can't afford this recipe. Thank you. Make sure that these are always going. How is production over here going? Bad, I mean. Not great, not bad. 500 wire. We need 150 iron plates and 150 broad. Well, our iron plate production is skyrocketed, so, yep. Just what I thought. That's amazing. Get that going. The thing that used to hold us down is now faster. You guys have kind of been producing the whole time, so we should have plenty of you. There we go. Get it done. Milestone reached. You have unlocked several structures aimed to provide the first needed to build basic factory infrastructure. Additionally, the biofuel blueprint will ensure improved fuel consumption of biomass burners. Additionally, you can now build the space elevator, which is integral to your contribution to project assembly. Okay. Well, the space elevator can now be used. Very nice. What do we need for Mr. Space Elevator? Ooh. I mean... There's no power in you. You've run out of power. Gonna go look at how much it costs to make this biodiesel, biofuel. Takes four biomass. Okay, let's go pick some plants. Just a few. We don't need a ton because what I'm going to do is make biofuel and go chop down trees for wood to make more biomass to make more biofuel. Hello, cave. Oh, this was just like a shortcut. Interesting. Kind of like a shortcut to our base if we wanted to go from up there. Very interesting. We can actually probably build the space elevator. Very soon. It's going to be a longer episode. Feeling it.
Okay. I do not know the efficiency of biofuel, but we'll find out. Oh, that tree that's stuck in the middle of my base. Where is it? Where is it? Can't get to you. No. <laughs> Eventually. Not enough space. Oh. Interesting. Okay, we want to keep plate production going, so we're going to need to throw in some of this biofuel. need them to produce faster. Sorry, iron plate. I'm taking you two. Four hundred of those, two hundred and fifty iron plates. This should be producing way faster now. Yep. Yeah, we slowed down our little iron plate, but we have so many. Getting the iron rod out quicker is just as nice. Along with if I could find more, you know what I mean, power slugs, that would also be a good thing. Yeah, this is much easier. Oh, our copper industry has run out of power. Run up our conveyor belt. Something's going to get pissed at me in this planet for cutting down trees. I know they are. <laughs> Got limestone for that? Huh. We now have 60 wood. Quite a bit. We also have to go see what our yellow slug research got us. There we go. I think we're in a good spot now. Head back. I see a slug way over there. I love the view distance in this game. Works very well. I can see much farther. But alright guys, we're going to end this episode here. Thank you guys for joining me for today's episode. Next episode, we will be building the space elevator. And hopefully figuring out how to open that drop pod. So next time guys, have a wonderful day.